We're back with the OG, the original Fallout Part freaking 7. And uh, yeah, I don't know why, but my game just quit last episode. But we're back here at the hub. And I actually got to change my perk because I had to replay all those missions because we did not save. So now I have animal awareness. So the animals will not attack me, which is very, very nice. I think we're going to give Ian this gun. Which is .223. 14.223F. Oh god, I gotta sneeze. God, I feel like I start every episode by uh, sneezing, man. All of them. I want them all. I know it's a lot of money, it's a big, big purchase, but. It's gonna be well worth it in the long run, I'm pretty sure. Okay. I'm just gonna pay uh, outright with some caps. And I'll actually give you. FMJ, I think, is the ammo for that. I'm actually gonna give you. I'll give you four flares, buddy. Boom. Not worth as much as I thought they'd be worth. Okay. I guess we'll just keep going then. It's all my money. Forget Ian also has a lot of my shit though. One fifty. Okay, thank you, sir. Okay, because we're headed to the the glow in today's episode. We're doing a quest for the Brotherhood. Can I see what you have? You have the fourteen millimeter. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna talk to you. I'm actually going to barter here. What I'm going to do... Is I'm going to take your one gun. Well, never mind. No, give me a sec, guys. Give me a sec. I'm going to figure this out. Uh, inventory. That is... 0.233 FMJ. I think that does more damage. And what does this take though? 0.223 FMJ. Okay. Yeah, so I'm gonna barter with you, buddy. I'm gonna take your your gun. And I'm gonna give you this gun. Which is worth way more. And I'm gonna give you all this ammo too. And that's what I'm gonna offer you. And you're gonna take it, and I'm gonna talk to you. And I'm gonna say, draw your best weapon next time we go into battle. Okay. And then, what I gotta do is we're changing our build here. We're going shotgun, plasma, crank that in there. What does this take? Small energy. Hello, sir. Do you have small energy? That's what I need. Pulse grenade. Flamethrower feel. I just don't know if you have what I need. Small energy cells. There we go. 2,000, uh, what if I gave you this, four of these, it's just, it's not enough, what if I gave you one of these, gets me closer, what about a radio, I don't know what a radio does, 
I mean, if we're going, if we're going that route, let me take that back. Let me take all those back. I think that's a fair trade, buddy. I think even that is just, with the rest of our caps. Ooh, it's, take it, take it. No. How about I give you uh, two nuclear colas as well? All the nuclear colas. Oh, oh, oh! I guess I'll take these all back. That's the best we're gonna do here. Thanks. Then if we go inventory cells, we can reload that. I don't know how many cells it takes, but. Yeah, there we go. Then we can uh, actually get headed towards the uh, the glow. The glow. To retrieve some shit for the brotherhood. But we're gonna need our radix. That's for sure. And then, uh... Yeah, we're gonna be playing all the Fallout games, just like we do with the Yakuza franchise, but after we finish this one, we're going back to Yakuza, Yakuza 4, man. And then we're gonna play Fallout 2, and we're gonna do Yakuza 5, Fallout 3, well, Fallout Brotherhood Tactics, technically, but we're gonna actually play that later, because that's technically a, uh, a side game. This place is like really far, man. Like super far. But like I said, we got animal awareness, so we don't have to fight all the animals if we run into them along the uh, the way. Okay, how do I get in here? Okay, I need a rope. I need a rope. Whoops. All right, here we are. So I kind of like how we're, we're, we're playing this a little. It's like we do uh, do each of the towns each episode. So last episode we did Necropolis. This episode we'll be doing The Glow. The next episode, probably The Brotherhood of Steel because we'll be able to join after they do all that. And what I'm gonna do is done. I want all your books, buddy. I know. Big book of science, eh? I will take all your books to read. Okay, uh... What am I gonna give you in return? I give you a gun? I think I'll... I think I'd even be... Oh, I already gave Rudimac an offer. I don't need the bazooka. What I need is the caps. Just saying. Genuinely, what I need, and I really need some stim packs too. Oh, give me all your stim packs. Come on, that's fair. I don't think that's a bad deal. I don't think that's a bad deal. No. Give me one. Well, no, no, no. One. Why is it? Why would it let me input that if I can't even do that? Okay. Here you go. Alright. 
It's a fair trade, right? And what I need to do is equip our rope. And we also need to make sure that we use our uh, radix right when we get there. Otherwise, we will be fucked. Heavily, heavily fucked. So what is the glow, though? Is it a town of, like, unmutated ghouls? I don't think so, because that was what Necropolis was. Necropolis was the, uh, the ghoul town. Well, we'll figure it out once we get there. Okay. Uh, down to the glow we go. I know there's more companions in this game than just Ian, Tycho, and Dogmeat. So I gotta make sure we get the third companion if we can. Okay. Glow. We're gonna enter. We're gonna go inventory. We need to use our Radix right away. One. Two. Wait, I need Rat X, don't I? What? Okay. I need Rad X, not Rad Away. I guess we cured our fucking radiation, though. See, they're friendly. We don't have to fight the rats. I like that. They're just, they're just our homies now. What sucks is for me to get this rad X or rad way. Rad X is what we need. I gotta buy it from the drug dealer and I don't think he's willing to, willing to sell it to me is the issue. We'll see, I'm gonna try to, try to bargain here without killing the whole town. Who are you? Good to meet you, Vance. What do you have to sell? Oh my god, thank god, dude. I thought he wasn't gonna sell to me. Rat away. Need the Rat X. Oh, 900. Oh, give it all, buddy. Take it all. Take it all. Good, good talks with you. This is the place we always find ourselves back at. Okay, uh, I'm gonna read these books too while we're here. There we go. First aid at 101%. 
beautiful. And then uh, we're gonna gamble a little, guys. I wanna, I wanna gamble, dude. I wish you could play like blackjack in this. That'd be pretty cool. If that was an option, but uh, Decker's dead. So I don't necessarily really know if we can gamble or not, you know? We'll, uh, we'll see. We'll, 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 uh, check it out. Winner. Okay. Winner. Oh. Oh. Ugh. Let me play. Five. 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 Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give oh, dude, no. It's not as fun as in uh, New Vegas where you actually get to, to play real black. Dude, I, I've scammed those casinos. I've taken all their money, bro. 12,000 caps a casino. Okay, now we're actually gonna make our progress towards the glow. Hopefully. We will see. We will see. Glorious sanctimonium. Ah, uh, just a dude. Don't care about you. Sorry. Sorry! Sorry, buddy. Sorry. Don't care, don't care. Oh, still don't care. Oh, guess what? Still don't care. Guess what? Guess what? Oh, oh, oh. Still don't care. <laughs> oh, it's funny. Alright. Inventory. Two of these, right? 100% radiation. Okay. Well, I think that's uh, it's enough radiation resistance to explore this, hopefully. Okay, here we are. I guess uh, this is more of a explore the zone type of thing. Bodies, bodies, bodies. Nope, nothing there. Okay. Anything in here? I see some lockers, eh? Take rat away. Make sure our radiation's all set up once we get out of here. I feel like I'm broke now, man. Like, I think I have everything I need, but I'm pretty broke now. Which can be annoying, but it's not the uh, the end of the world, right? All right, so there's an elevator. Okay, since a trap nearby. Oh, yay! I sensed it, but I did not detect it. That's for damn sure. Rat away. There we go. That stuff sells for a. Uh, Hefty penny. Uh, we could give that to uh, what's his face, Ian, if we wanted to. What's yonder this way? I just don't want to stay in here for too long. I don't know how long the uh, the radiation resistance. I don't think there's anything in there. I see a dead brotherhood of steel, dude. Nothing in here except a locker. Okay. 
Okay. Motion sensor. Fix tool. Big book of science. I don't want to read that in here, though. Oh, great. There's traps everywhere. All right, we got a hollow disc and a yellow pass key. Pop open our pit boy. Status, mutant transformations. Oh, wait, I gotta use it first. Okay. Gotta activate the hollow disc. And then we'll just discard it. We don't need it. Then we can go pit boy. Then we can go status. And we got ancient brotherhood tape. Captain Maxim was right. This place is death. I'm writing this so that if we don't make it back, someone someday might find out what happened to us. We made it to West Tech Research Facility after 20 days of hell, but that was the easy part. The radiation levels began to shoot up as soon as we could see the giant crater. We checked our supplies and figured with our armor and our anti-rad supplies, we'd be fine for at least a day of exploring. We felt it was calculated risk, but the technology we held the potential of recovering was worth it. We climbed down the crater to the first level, and everything seemed to be according to plan. The power was off, so we didn't need to circumvent the security, or so we thought. There wasn't much of a value on this level, so we pushed on. The second level was more of the same. When Jinshin dropped at the third level, all hell broke loose, and security sensors had been buried out on the first two levels. But not on the third. Jensen was cut to ribbons before he knew what had happened. We'd never seen weapons cut through power armor like that. Men started dropping right and left, and the ones who were still alive lost it. I tried to regroup, but only Santo and Carmelo made it back up here to the first level with me. The fact that I could smell soldiers burning flesh... Rizama <coughs> 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 taken taking off means the power armor is no longer airtight, so I'm sucking up. A lot more rads than I had planned on. I'm leaking hydraulics at an alarming rate. We need... To get far enough away from this place before my armor dies. Carmelo seemed fine physically, but wandered off about an hour ago, mumbling something about Jahina. That bastard has all the anti rad. That leaves Soda and myself. We can't make it far enough away from this without the anti rad. So I've got to try to find Carmelo before it's too late. Sergeant D. Allen of the United States. Alright. Here's a terminal. Power management, secondary power, primary power. Initialize primary power. Air, 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 okay. I, I guess just the secondary power is on. Alright, so basically people die here. Cool. Good to unknow. I guess we'll have to see if we can take the elevator. Okay, it shocked me, so I'm assuming we got to use a key card, right? Maybe? Look at that. Boom. Alright, we'll go to level two. Uh, we could probably use science here. Oh, okay. That's just power management again. Alright, good to know. Ah, there's a whole bunch of robots. Hmm. I'm gonna kill these. I think we can kill these robots. Oh, why do they... I don't like that they don't take, uh... Much damage. Here we go. This will serve us better, right? Dead. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to keep my shoddy. Well, is what it is. Dog me and uh, Ian will take care of these, right?
I don't trust robots because we turn the power back on. You know who else is getting up? These darn damn robots. If that's what we're even doing, I don't know. That one was killed. Told him to use his best weapon, so is it not? I thought I gave him the other pistol. Maybe that is the pistol. I don't know. Get him, get him, dog meat. Oh, it was killed, okay. Yeah, I don't, I just, I don't trust these robots, bro. I don't trust robots, all right? Let that, uh, let that be known, all right? Missiles, well, I sold my rocket launcher. Because I'm not putting any points into big guns. So there's really no point to even... I mean, I can sell it, though. So that's why we're taking all this stuff. Is really because we're going to... We're going to sell it later. But I also don't want to carry too much, right? Okay. Got a whole bunch of dead bodies down here. Nice, nice. Here we go. Nothing. Oh, grenade. I'll take a grenade. I don't use grenades, but I will uh, take one. Flame or feel. Boom, boom. You can always have Ian hold some stuff if we're getting a little too too heavy on, on items. Did I not open that door? Here we go. A red key card, okay. Let it cook, let it cook. I mean, we don't have to really check in there. I think we just go down to the next level, right? Forget that that requires the uh, the yellow key card. Oh, there we go. Okay, level three it is. I don't really know uh, what we're looking for here, but I guess we just keep going down, right? I mean, this is. Just Apparently the last, the last of the levels, or so they, uh, so they say. Boom. Let's activate combat. Take out these robots.
Get him. Get him. You're dead, right? You only got like 60 points, I think. Okay. That's all those robots cleared out. Let's uh, explore a little more. Looks like there's a different elevator. That one probably takes the other key card. Okay, I don't think there's gonna be anything in these two rooms, but we can uh, check these four lockers up here. Make way! Make way! So there are more levels. I was gonna wondering what the red key card was for. All done. Go over here. This is a very point point and click adventure, boys. Boom. Dude, I am stocked up on the stimmies. What a day, what a day, what a day. Uh, we don't need any of that. I mean, shit, I should probably take it just to just to sell it, right? Oh, boom, boom. Check this one. Ian, everyone here has been a good good pals of ours, you know. Really, really starting to bond with the with the fam bam. Okay, I'm assuming we're gonna need the uh, other key card here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna plop that there. We're gonna use the red key card this time on that door. Granted access. And we're missing level five, so we're gonna go to level four first. We got some bodies in here. I did not mean to shoot you, dog meat. I'm sorry. Let that be known. It wasn't. It wasn't personally against you. Inventory. God damn it. I should have done this earlier. I was already in my inventory. Okay. We're going to go turn. It looks like there's like a big nucleus. Nucleus. The powerhouse of the cell. Dead. Deceased. Oh, dude. We leveled up. Look at that. Uh, energy weapons. We're still gonna go up. Keep going up on energy weapons, man. That is the, uh, the way to do it. Alright, so there's an elevator here. But I don't think we have a different key card. Because so far the elevators have had to use, uh, different key cards. Maybe though. I am uh, starting to run out of carrying capacity. Uh, can I barter with you, buddy? Can I give you some weapons? Just temporarily, I'm gonna give you that. Temporarily, I'm gonna give you that. Temporarily, I'm gonna. Mm, I'm gonna give it to you for now. Offer. There you go, buddy. Just don't die. Because if you die, I'm a little fucked, alright? I don't think there's any enemies down here except the robots. Missiles. Okay.
Let's just check this room really quick. Oh, I went a little too early. I didn't even open the door. What are these? Could contain a human or a larger sized body. Could, but it's not. Okay. What is this? It speaks! How may I be of assistance? Who or what are you? I am a machine intelligence dedicated to research installation control. I am called Zax. <coughs> what kind of research? I'm specifically programmed for the research into biological studies, including pathology, genetic research. My primary function is the exploration of information at complex levels exceeding human capacity. So you're pretty smart, eh? I am beyond a typical rating in human terms. However, it would be safe to say that no more than one ten billionth of the history of human population can match my reasoning. Uh, yeah. I'm delighted to have been of assistance. You didn't tell me much. Uh, tell me about this installation. West Tech Research Facility founded in 2002 as a private contractor for the United States government. The company initially consisted of two divisions of advanced weapon research and the biomedical science division in 2069. West Tech was the single largest contractor of the United States government. Its largest contract being powder infantry armor model T-51B. Whoops. T-51B in light of significant advance in 2076 by the NBC of the Pan Immunity Viron Project. The United States Defense Department, in fear of international espionage, moved a team out to the site to secure and oversee the project, now dubbed the FEV, Forced Evolutionary Virus Project. Thanks for the info. I'm delighted to have been of assistance. Tell me more! Uh, Want to play a game of chess? I'd be delighted. I don't know why they say that. Uh, grant me access to the mainframe. Access granted. Main menu. Base information. West Tech Research Facility founded in 2002 as a private contractor for the United States government. The company is initially considered of two divisions, the Advanced Weapon Research and the Biomedical Science Division. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I already know that. Security information. Security robots inactive. Okay, research information. Research records are current on the West Tech Research Facility. Research based employee records. Some records, research assistant, Blue Military Base. Nick Davis, director. John Isaac, assistant. Steve Mako, assistant. Head of laser development, Charles Brickhole. My shell, lieutenant lab technician, Aaron Shellman. Okay. Download records to the pit boy. Power armor status. The T-151B powered infantry armor is designed with the latest passive defense features for both civilian and military disturbances. The back-mounted TX-28 microfusion pack generated 60,000 watts to power the high-flow hydraulic system built into the frame of the suit made of the latest polylaminate composite. The T-51B shell is... Is... Wait, where am I at? is lightweight and capable of absorbing over 25,000 jolts of kinetic impact. The 10 micron silver altif coating can reflect laser and radiation emission without damage to the composite surface. All right, download the records. FEV 273, as China became increasingly aggregated with their use of biological weapons, the United States government felt that the countermeasure was needed. Pan Immunity Vision Project PVP was officially formed September 15, 2073. 2075, it became clear that the best way to combat the newly created biological weapon was to alter uninfected DNA so that it was no longer susceptible to standard viral infection. 2076, unforeseen side effects began surfacing in early 2076 with the PVP animal test subjects began showing on abnormal growth rates accompanied by... Increased brand activity, the U.S. government took notice of these discoveries and in the internet of national security moved a team on site to secure and oversee the project, which was now dubbed the FEV, Voice Evolutionary Virus. Download. Terminate program. Dude, I thought it was about to blow up. That would have been crazy, huh? If it, like, blew up. I don't even think there's anything in here for us. Maybe in here.
Looks like we have a blue key card. Okay. Wait, no, done, done. Am I available? Possibly. God, I got so much shit now. To use that blue pass key on this elevator. We will uh, find out, right? By, of course, using it. And I cannot use it. Emergency power is not functional enough to do that. Okay. So I guess we got to go to floor six. I forget. We need a red key card. It's just a little annoying. Having to flip through all these key cards. All right, level six. Okay. I see here something we may be able to interact with. Power manage primary power offline. Reinitiate primary power. Okay. Is this the generator? Start the back if you see a generator. Okay, uh, I believe if we use one of these, we should be able to try to repair that, right? Beautiful. And now, reinitialize primary. Whoa! Dude is way brighter in here. Is that a dead child? Is that a dead child? We're just gonna walk away. We saw nothing. Well, I shouldn't do that, man. That makes me worse of a human. Oh, God. Okay. Blue key card. We're gonna head to level five, which would be this way. Oh. Well, the robots are back. The robots are alive. This is why I prepared. What damage do they do? What they what they got guns? They can carry guns? Okay, I'm gonna die that I don't do health, dude. Never in my life would I think I would've seen that, though, dude. That robot shooting that gun looked goofy as hell. Goofy as all hell. Okay, I can't do nothing. Okay, now we're gonna end combat. Well, this is a good chance to use first aid on myself. Uh, looks like that wasted a little time. I'm gonna pop some, uh... Alright, nothing happens. Okay, so our red X is still very active and kicking. Cool. Dude, I thought we were prepared, man. I came in here with my little, my little raddies. All right, here we go. Is this how we reach level five? I'm expecting some robot combatants here. Yep, there they are. Let's target, uh, if we can, the big boys first. Can I get two in? No.
It's gonna oh dude, they're all coming, bro. Oh, there's a lot. Get him, please. Well, I can't do anything. I'm, I'm just, I'm trapped here. I guess we'll use it to reload, right? Okay, we're gonna go for him. There we go. Nine hit points. Just attack me. No, don't attack Ian. You're gonna shoot. Okay, you're gonna shoot me. Shoot me, yes. You guys do more damage. I'm more worried about big brain bots. What is that, a knife bot? Knife bot? Okay, dead. Last one. Is dog meat dead? No. Dude, our dog's just gone, bro. I don't feel like redoing everything. The dog is gone. It's just Ian, man. It's just me and Ian now. Oh, I'm sad. Oh, you're just gonna keep running, huh? Can only go so far before we catch up. I gotta avenge my dog. Oh, Ian, our dog's dead. We no longer have a have a dog friend. I'm a little sad. All right, what else are we looking for here, though? Oh, it's just me and Ian. No. I hear at some point you have to kill your dog, anyways. So I guess it's not the uh, the end of the world. All right, we got a hollow disc in here. Everyone, comment "Rest in Beavis dog dog meat." Status. Oh, FEV experiment tape. I am not reading all that. Just know we have it. We have retrieved it. We've received it. It's there. I don't feel like reading. I've done enough reading today. Another set of combat armor. Ah. Uh, oh, it probably sells for so much, though, bro. I bet you it sells for so much. Uh, does that give me enough space? Nope. What did I get rid of the other missiles? Yes. Okay. Good. 
The dog is dead. Just let it be known that the dog is dead. Plasma rifle. I wish I'd take it, but we actually Ian already has our other plasma rifle. Do these have anything in them? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? I'm just gonna give you everything, buddy. Anything that weighs a ton. I'm gonna give you it all. Don't worry, guys. We're, we're gonna steal it back eventually, but... It'd be important to give this all to him. Offer. Nope, never mind. Of course, he's gonna make me. Well, I'm gonna take all the guns. Let's see what's in here. We'll go to the next one. Dude, the loot is impeccable. I need those. I need those. We the solder. Oh, but I just I can't carry them. Whoa, is that a minigun? Come on. Ian, buddy. I gotta speak with you again. I gotta barter. I'm gonna give you a whole bunch of shit. Alright. You're gonna take it. You're gonna take it all. You're the you're the pack meal, alright? That is a good trade, bro. You got all of it for free. But I'm, uh, I'm gonna end up stealing it back eventually. Just let that be known. I'm letting you, letting you have it temporarily. It's still too heavy. What do I need to give up to be able to hold this? Let me take the minigun. No, I still, dude, I still gotta, I still gotta give you more shit. Give you all these. I can give you this. Give you all this. Give you this dynamite. I'll even, I'll even give you all this ammo here. Let me just get the minigun, dude, and then I'll stop searching stuff. But I want the minigun. Okay, we got it. I'm gonna check the rest of these in case there's like a hollow tape or anything. I don't want to miss out. God, it's so much good loot. There it is. Okay. And then we're going to open this door and we're going to get out of here, man. I just gotta see what's in here. Another hollow disc. Another hollow disc? No, but I'll take the stim packs. I'll take the rat away. I'll even take the health kit. And we're gonna go inventory. Chop it all the way down. Hollow disc, activate, throw done okay where's this elevator here we go and I think we've cleared out all the other robots so we should be good buddy it's a good run dog meat I'm, I'm sorry it had to uh had to be this way buddy but uh we're leaving you 
We're leaving you behind. I don't feel like redoing everything I just did, so... Just so you're aware. We're gonna go to four. Head back towards this elevator. Getting our inventory really quick. We're gonna need the red key card. We're gonna use that on that. Go into here. We're gonna go to three. Once we're at level three, we're gonna go back down with the yellow key card and make our way to this elevator. I don't necessarily like this place. I don't like that we have to do all this elevator key card crap. It's honestly a little bit annoying. But I wouldn't say it's the, uh, the end of the world. And we're gonna go back to level one. And we're gonna get the hell out of here. I'll tell you what happened, Ian. Our dog's dead. Dead. Big dead. Big debtors. Alright, we're gonna head to the Brotherhood of Steel. Love that. Uh, I don't have my plasma weapon. So we're stuck using our shotgun. And I should have reloaded it, but that's okay. Alright, that's Ian. I'm just gonna fight the dudes with the armor. I don't know which one's Ian. This is when that one perk would uh, come in handy. All right, we know who Ian is now. That's our old pal, Ian. Yeah, you guys can run off if you want, but not gonna get far I could tell you that much what are they about to dip I'd love you to dip Okay, we're doing good.
What are the odds, bro? I feel like he does way more damage than me. Yeah, they don't want the smoke. You're gonna make me really chase this guy out of here. Really gonna do me like that game? All right, we'll let you walk scot free this once. But you're dead. You're dead meat next time, buddy. Pal. Friend. Okay, real quick, I want to check the uh, the status. We went to the glow. The glow has been completed. Brotherhood, we have not done. We've completed the hub. We've completed Necropolis. We've completed Junk Town. We've completed Shady Sands, finally. And Vault 13, destroy mutant leaders, destroy source of mutants. Okay. Well, I'm back, buddy. Hey, you're back. Did you get something? Sure did. Great. But um, the High Elder said you have to give it to me before I can let you in. Sorry. You don't need to lie. Just come back when you have something. Hey, you're back. Great. But um, the High Elder said you have... You don't need to lie. Just come back when you have something. Do I not have something? What if I give you, uh, this? What? I went to the glow, but the Brotherhood says I have nothing. He's saying something about uh, intelligence. Do I have Mintats? Hey, you're back. Great. But um, the high. You don't need to lie. Just come back when you have. No. I'm gonna have to save like on three. Dog dead. Okay, we're gonna have to go back to the glow then. I think I had to bring him one of the uh, the hollow tapes, and I tossed all my hollow tapes out.
I don't know why I threw them all out. But we probably need that first one that we got. That's what we're going to need. Well, we wasted not not a lot of time, but I could have been uh, easily avoided if we just didn't toss it out. Back to the old brotherhood we go. And it is a long trek. Okay. I was probably feeling feeling the rads a little. They have a Geiger counter where you can like check, but I think that's going to be the only place with heavy radiation. It's literally called the glow. Like, there's the glowing sea. There's all these places with massive, massive radiation. And I don't think any of these other places are going to have massive radiation. So there's two more places that we don't know where the location is. So what we're going to do, I mean, I guess what the... Oh, dude, don't tell me I'm addicted to Mintats. I only took one! I only took one! I can't be traveling this slow, broski. Family of mole rats, good thing. There's not that's not a family of mole rats. That is a singular singular fucking mole rat, alright? Games off the 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 Benjamin or something. Okay, I got what you need now, buddy. Hey, you're back. Did you get something? Great. But, um, the High Elder said you have to give it to me before I can let you in. Sorry. This is great! Hang on while I open the door. Get it, Buzz. Alright, can I ask you questions now? Oh, hello. What can I help you with? Can I ask questions now? Go ahead. Uh, what exactly do you do, buddy? I greet people at the gates and decide whether to let them in. You and the merchants are about the only ones that get in now because the elders seem like they're preparing for something. Do you know what it could be all about? Uh, I don't know, but uh, I've heard the High Elder arguing with the other elders. I got more. Go ahead. Uh, have you heard any good rumors lately? Well, some of the initiates think we're preparing for war. That's why hardly anyone gets in now. I was surprised when the High Elder told me to let you in. Uh, I don't know, but uh, I've heard the High Elder arguing with the other Elders. Goodbye. Alright, Buzz Lightyear doesn't have much to say. Alright guys, well I'm gonna save the game here on Dog, Dead Dog. Dog Dead. And uh, yeah! Thank you for watching. Next episode we're gonna be doing some Brotherhood of Steel stuff. Peace out.